Go to the Tools panel of Photoshop and select the Rectangle tool. Go up here, select Shape. Also set the Fill to Black, Green, etc. and apply a rectangle. So once you've done that, now go to Polygon tool. So there's the Polygon tool. Set the sides to 3 or even better, use the Triangle tool. So Triangle tool there, quickly create a triangle. Now with that triangle, I'm just going to rotate it. You can resize it in numerous ways. Don't have to have it this size. You could just sort of maybe create a very big triangle like that. Like that. Press return. Now you can align it. So I'm just going to quickly align it. So you don't have to. Again, you can make, of course, multiple rectangles here as well. Whole load of different designs. Just there. Once you've done that, you can go to a layer and combine shapes and use unite shapes. Then go over here to the direct selection tool. You can see the direct selection tool there. Select all of this design. So it's all selected. All the points have been selected. Then you go up here, the middle. You can see here, merge shape components. Select that. It's become one complete shape now. What you can then do is go to edit and define custom shapes. So you can save your arrow design that way. Of course, you can also, if you wish, just simply create a rectangle and Go over here again, create another triangle, and you don't have to keep the same color. You can maybe go there, set that, maybe apply some other effects, rotate that again, maybe create that sort of triangle, press turn, you got that, just quickly align it so it looks just right. Once you've done that, what you can do, you can go to layer, smart objects, and convert to smart objects. So you've got a slightly different sort of arrow design like that. And of course, what you can also do is you can apply effects to it. So you can go to filters, maybe go for blur, Gaussian blur, etc. So create a variety of different designs. Maybe go down to the bottom to effects, maybe go for color overlay, drop shadow, and so on. Click OK. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.